All four days, gone with the three word. Happy with that one. A little. Uh, got some release back in these fairways now. Cannot go left of it because the angle of the ridge eats in that side. It's gone out to the safely there and spins it down. Going left, it may come back a little right. Yeah, super try. And he loves that little hold off fade. That's his go to shot, and it's been working. Uh, we haven't seen anything go left going left this week. This looks good. Oh, talk about brave. Right at it, took the paintwork off the flag. It's back uphill. He's got to hit it. Yeah, solid. There you go. Just like that. So Tiger gets a quick two shot swing on Ricky. Down the left hand side. Might be a bit riskier, but gives a better line into the hole. Smack in the middle for Tiger. <laughs> Leaning as if it's right of where he Can wanted it to be. No, right over the flagstick. This putt here, very quick coming down the hill. Just under 20 feet. Oh. Yeah, a foot harder, it would have gone in. Tiger eyeing another birdie from seven feet at the fifth. And he moves within three of Levine's lead. One sixty-eight, seven iron flag in the middle of the green. Oh, smart play. Got to get past that whole location today. Knows it. Wow, that's going to send a roar back down the fairway to Levine. To seven. Okay, we got a par five. We got a bunker down the left hand side. It's 300 to hit it over it. Well, he's not taking on that bunker. This is right down the heart of the fairway. Peter, we've had two eagles here today. That's the bunker we're talking about right there. Well, that's a five wood high and to the right from 253. He's begging. He got it. He got it. This will be for the third eagle of the day, Tiger Woods. That, if he could make that little putt right there. Is that two birdies in a row? This will be an eagle. Oh, oh man, it can't get much closer than that. He knew it too. That's three in a row. That's uh, putting the ball where he wants it. Amazing when he's back there from 255 yards, calling for it to fly one yard. Just get up one more yard and he clears that bunker. Eight. 188, that's a cut seven iron. Pole location way back in the back right. Looked to me like his foot slipped a little bit in, and that's uh, off the bank and into the sand. Not an easy up and down from there either. This is downhill lie. He's, he's going to have to just play this long. Really had no shot. He actually went up and looked at the far edge of the green to see if he, if he put it further up toward the fringe, might it roll back, but not enough slope.
Not quite enough speed to hold that line. That will be a bogey for Tiger. Over at nine with Tiger's second shot on the way. He's got 144 and elected to go up and over the trees right in front of him with a nine iron. Yeah, the flag's on six. Yeah, that was smart. Tenth hole. I think he likes it. Well, unlike yesterday, Gary, he went with driver today, cut it off the bunker beautifully. Uh, this is a double crossed seven yeah. iron from 174, trying to cut it and pull Ooh, hook it. That's the first one we've seen all week. Now he's got to decide whether he wants to fly it over the ridge or run it up over the ridge to get it to the hole. He's going a little low there and trying to scoot it up, but it bit. It landed right into the ridge. And that's going to be a very awkward 18-footer for his par. Uh, opening volley here on the back nine. Tigers trying to win his fourth, mem fifth memorial. He took a three wood and tried to cut it off the hazard and hit it dead straight just inside the hazard line. It's well, safe in, but he has stress on his layup. <laughs> yes, he will. Those trees on the left will be in his way. You can see what we got here. We're going to have to hit a hard hook, but he got the lie for it. And the stream dissects the fairway here and then all the way up the right side. So second shot layup, very important here at 11. Nicely done for Tiger. Well played. Sensible shot. Well, let's watch this follow through. A little punch into the breeze. Wind picking up. That's a little knockdown from 109. Just control the trajectory here. Beautiful shot. Treated it with too much respect. Didn't even get it to the hole from inside eight feet. You won't be happy with that one. This is my boat. Fight. Well, Fight. this is out to the left Fight. once again. Is it, is it gonna go? Oh, it's fine. Wow, that's a 60, 70 feet. Another pull. Three pulls in a row. Let's go to 12 green. Well, I don't even know how you size this one up. Yeah, uphill moving left as it gets to the top of the ridge, then downhill and picking up speed to the right. Oh, it's looking good. Oh, I'm surprised that didn't get down there. Oh, okay. Two putts from 80 feet. That's good stuff. 13. Hmm. 455. Hole turns to the left. There's a bunker out there at about 290 over it. You can aim at it. That is absolutely perfect. 13. Tiger Woods. Now 165 laid back off the tee. That's a downwind, downhill pitching wedge. Got his eyes on it, Peter. Likes it. Yeah. Yeah, not bad. It looks like it's about 15, 18 feet away there for his birdie. He is currently two back. Tiger after his wedge shot in there. That putt always looks like it's going to break more right than it does to me. All right, let's go to 14. And Tiger hit a beautiful iron shot down here yesterday. And I might add another one today. Look at that. In there on 14. Yeah, this is a beauty. 135 yard sand wedge on the way. Oh, we just needed a little less through the air or a little more spin.
and almost another chip in from behind the 14th green. This one's extremely important. Bangs it in the middle. To 15 tee. A big tee shot here with the driver. Tiger Woods on the par five. Good job. That looked a nice swing. Well, finally he has hit one right down the heart of the fairway. This should be no problem. Tiger is ready to pounce. You would think Peter Costas back there on the par five again. Going yep. forward in two. This is the Tiger moment. It's 221. He's got a three iron. Oh, he, he loves, loves it. it. You can yeah. already tell. Urging it. Oh, he pounded it and like uh, Jonathan Burden just misses the ridge. That's what he was looking yeah. for to get into that bowl. The, the little backstop. Looking for an eagle putt that he'll try to feed to the hole. Just to tie for the lead, too. Has better pace than perfect John. line. Oh, it's going to be fractionally too high. Just straightened out at the end, but still well done. Tiger to seven under. Sixty six guys have played this hole. Ten guys have hit the green. Ten. Well, this one's going to fly to the very back at least and yeah, boink one hop over. Hop, they won't hop it over. If they miss it, it'll right a little bit more goes in a bunker. And if you hit the flag, it goes in a bunker. Over at 16, what do you see from this position? He's going to have to go vertical with uh, with the super high lob and just take his chances. But I'd say anything inside of six feet would be a wonderful oh, shot. Oh, I guess. Straight up. Oh, yeah, look at this, Peter. Look at this shot. Look at this, might go in, might go in, might go in. It is in. <laughs> he couldn't chip it in on 14, but he did it here on 16. That was incredible. And he's tied for the lead. Does that remind you of anybody? One guy, that guy. Not Not using the wind. driver, Peter's using the three wood today. Yeah, he's laying back again. Very good swing. Not not a problem. Bending down to pick up that tee quickly again, like the Tiger of old. Second for Tiger at 17, Peter. 198, and that is a massively high night iron downwind. Spectacular good play, shot. Ian, though. I think he just took long out of play. He certainly did. Let's get there right now. Ian, talk to me, talk to me, talk to me. What's he got? Well, after that uh, amazing nine iron from that far back, he's got 20 feet, one inch left for a birdie three. Well, it was excellent speed. Haven't seen many putts hold here at 17 today, I must say. Only 11 birdies. He'll go ahead and clean this one up to remain eight under par heading to the last. And I'm sure he knows, Peter, that he now has the one shot advantage over Sabatini and Romero in the clubhouse. As we go to 18T, Tiger. Very rhythmical, very confident swing right there, gentlemen. Just what he wanted. At the 18th, Tiger Woods is in the fairway here with a one shot lead. And if he is able to close it out here today, it would be win number 73 would tie him with Jack Nicholas for second on the all time list. This has always been a pin he's been very comfortable with. Yeah, uh, nine iron well out to the right, trying to turn it back toward the hole. It's going to love it and now. This could be really good. It's going to be stiff. He has done this a number of times. Short birdie putt coming up. He's, He's done it again.
67 for Tiger. An amazing finish here. Birdies three of the last four holes, including the miracle shot at 16. Matching the low round of the day with Romero and J.B. Holmes and Greg Owen.